This happened at North Carolina University, NCU. Sadly, sadly, well, there have been demonstrations this past week in universities across America protesting against Israel and blaming the atrocities on Israel. So there was a demonstration at NCU against Israel. A Jewish professor in the university who is secular, very secular, and liberal, and atheist, heard about it. But he's a Jew. He's a human being. He has a sensitive heart. So he was outraged, and he came running to the demonstration, and he started to shout on top of his lungs, yelling at the protesters that they sound like Nazis. They're talking like Nazis, celebrating an organization that is so overjoyed to murder and burn Jewish babies. You're like Nazis, Nazis, Nazis. The police escorted him away from the demonstration, supposedly for his own protection. He went back to the university and then it was time for class. So he came into his lecture auditorium and he sat down to give his lecture. Before he begins, a young woman studying in his class comes over to him with a bouquet of flowers. And she presents it to him. So he asks her, what's this? So she says, I wanted to tell you how proud I am for what you just did outside. That you stood up for truth, you stood up for life, you stood up for love, you stood up for decency, you stood up for humanity, for heaven's sake. I am so proud of you and I was so moved by your behavior and the fact that you lost yourself. I wanted to show you my appreciation and gratitude. So here's a bouquet of flowers. So he looks at her and he says, you're probably Jewish. She says, no, I'm not. So he says, so why do you care so much? She says, because you're the chosen people. He looks at her and says, you have been in my class for a while. You know that I don't believe that. She looks at him and says, you may not believe it, but we all know it. In the darkness of this week, we also saw something else. May Oivaite Chakmeni, the Pasuk says, show me who hates you and I'll tell you who you are. When we are the people that Hamas hates and wants to see every one of us dead, it shows us who the Jewish people are. When your greatest enemies in history are Paroi, Haman, Nebuchadnezzar, Stalin, Hitler, Hamas, this means we must be such a good and holy people because if evil despises the Jews more than anything else, evil is very, very sensitive to its antithesis, to what threatens it. When we see who despises us, who hates us, if people who are capable of such barbaric, sadistic, inhumane evil, and to dance for it, to celebrate it. And they are the ones who hate the Jewish people. For them, we are their greatest threat. A little Jewish baby represents a threat to their existence. They gleefully want to murder her or him. What does this tell you? Ashrecha Yisrael Micha You belong to a people that embodies the deepest goodness and holiness and sanctity and morality and love and compassion and divinity and beauty and ecstasy in the world. That's something we need to celebrate. TheYeshiva.net